Okay, hey folks, we've got an energy drink to review here from Red Rain. Now, around here, Red Rain, like the regular Red Rain, you can get the shot of it, you can get the 8.5 ounce, 250 milliliter can, or you can get a big bottle of it. But the shot and the little bottle, they have the same amount of caffeine and everything for the ingredients, so you're better off with the bottle, because compared to the price of the shot, Depending where you buy it, you might get it maybe like 15 to 25 cents cheaper or the same price. And then I see all their like flavored red rains in the eight and a half ounce cans, but they'll just say like red rain and then what flavor it is. Well, Jeremy Slick, I like to watch some of his, like I watch his like reviews of energy drinks because, you know, I check them out and whatnot. And one day he had a 16 ounce uh, red rain called Downpour and it was a cherry limeade one. Well, I've never seen something like that around here before. Sounds good. Now, our Red Rains come from the Cox Beverage Company and are saying like Mississauga on them. Well, I have a Red Rain here that's coming from the Cox Company, but it's saying it's coming from Tampa Bay, Florida. So, um, I mean, I guess around the world. I don't know, like, if, if, if there's a Cox Beverage Company outside of North America, I have no idea, but I guess there's one... Cots company in the Canada part of North America and the US part and I guess they make different kind of red rains or whatever. What we have here is Red Rain Hydroplane. It's a berry pomegranate energy drink. Doesn't tell me any of the like ingredient levels and stuff on here, so I don't know if there's taurine in here. I have no idea what the caffeine level is. But our eight and a half ounce red rains or 80 milligrams of caffeine so I'm thinking this is anywhere between I'm guessing 80 to 160 so I'm thinking it could be 80 like how I'm used to seeing red rains but then because of the size maybe they did it to 100 or maybe it's like other energy drinks and 10 per thing so it could be 160 I don't know do you know the caffeine content on this and if there's any also from the Grana give it a try Lots of sugar in this, that's bullshit, but whatever. There's taurine, mental clarity and focus, energy drink, berry pomegranate flavored, energy drink with other natural flavors enhanced with B vitamins. Drop your and enjoy the ride. Okay. Smells like berry and pomegranate, kind of from the can. Cheers. Whoa, I see the carbonation things bubbles bouncing up there. Wow. Dark purple drink for the color. Smells kind of like a berry, kind of like a pomegranate, kind of a little bit like um, syrup, so I'll dive in now. You can taste some pomegranate, perhaps, and perhaps you can taste some berry there. Okay. Nothing I would say is too amazing, but nothing terrible. It's a little heavy and a little sour. And I guess all the flavors I'm getting are the berry pomegranate that it's supposed to be so... I don't know if you'll see me with other big red ring cans with different weird names and stuff ever again, but if you do, you do. Nothing wrong with this, but nothing super amazing, so it's alright. But because it's just like, you know, nothing wrong with it, but nothing super amazing, I'll just say 2 out of 5, it's alright. 
try on open. Oh, um, it's it's all right. <laughs> Again. Like I say, you can taste some of the berry and some of the pomegranate mixing together, which comes in a little heavy with a little bit of sourness. So, you know, it's all right. It's like a two to a five. No, I would give it out of a five, between a two and a two point three. It's okay, but nothing to like scream about and be like, "Yo, world, know about this one." But worth giving a shot, and it's cheap and whatnot, so thanks for viewing.